Hi and welcome. This is Sean here from PassFirstTime.ie, Ireland's online driving school. In this video, we are going to hopefully help you to hill start like a pro. This is a snippet taken from our pre-test course. Uh, the pre-test course, by the way, is still for the next two weeks at half price, starting at just 20 euro. It's the complete A to Z of preparing for your driving test. So check that out. In this snippet, we are going to take a look at the hill start, which is very important. Uh, that you practice it and that you're able to do it correctly because remember rolling back on a hill is not alone dangerous for normal driving it also could lead to driving test failure so we're going to go over to the car now to our pre-test course and take a look at uh, how you should take off correctly on a hill this is how you would do a hill start now a lot of driving tests these days don't get an obvious hill start like this where the examiner pulled you in and asked you to move away um, on a hill. They may take your, your overall use of the handbrake throughout your driving test into account. However, some tests still get an obvious and some examiners still do the obvious hill start. So we looked at the, the palm maneuver already, prepare, observe and move. And it's, it's the very same maneuver on a hill. The only difference is that on the hill you want to make sure your clutch is to bite and particularly driving a petrol car you probably want a little bit more gas to make sure you have enough power to move away on the hill but i'm just going to do this nice and slowly just to demonstrate it for you on this hill and the hill i'm on is you probably can't get it from the video but it's severe enough in other words if i release the handbrake my car does go rolling back down this hill so if i press down the clutch i pop her into first gear i set my gas i give a little purr and I bring my clutch to bite. I can feel my bonnet lifting slightly. If I bring it up too high, the car starts to, to move maybe when I don't want it, and I don't want that. So you want to get that biting point very comfortable. Get very comfortable with the biting point. At this stage, that's the, the P, the prepare. To observe, I check all around. There's nothing there, so I signal. And the M is to move. To move, I just release the handbrake. And the trick here is to hold your legs as they are. Leave them as they are. If she moves a little bit fine, if she doesn't bring her up a slight bit more, hold the leg steady for another little bit, count to three slowly, one, two, three, and then away. And off up to second gear. And you will get away calmly and smoothly every time. I'm just going to pull in and repeat that once more on a, an even more severe uh, hill here. So I stop, this is as you would do on the test. I secure my car with the handbrake and put her into neutral and cancel the signal. So one, two, three. That way everything is where it should be now. There's no fear of anything being out of zinc when I start. So to move off, I press down my clutch into first, set my gas and bring my clutch to bite. I can feel the little tow bonnet lifts or the boot goes down, whichever you prefer. Slight change in the sound of the engine as well. I check all around, signal if there's nothing there, release my handbrake and hold everything. See, this time I haven't moved, but if I bring my, up my clutch barely, the width of a coin, she starts to move, hold the leg again, and then count to three, one, two, three, gently up the rest of the way, a little bit of gas, and you're done. That's a hill start on a fairly severe hill, that one. So just follow those steps, and your hill starts should improve dramatically. Good luck with them. Well, hopefully you found that informative. The best way to get those results and to be able to move off without rolling backwards is to practice because practice does make perfect. And to get used to holding your leg at that biting point, get very friendly with that biting point. The tendency is to, as you release the handbrake, to move your left leg. Try it as long as it's to bite to hold the left leg in the same position until the handbrake is released fully. And then to bring it up that little, that width of a coin, and you should move away lovely and comfortably. So practice and hopefully you too will be able to hill start like a pro in the not too distant future. Check out our free driving test tips secrets mini course on our website passfirsttime.ie if you would like more information on prepping for your driving test. We will have another driving test quick tips video coming your way very shortly. So good luck with your test and safe motoring from all of us here at Pass First Time. And as always, if you got value out of this video, please like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you to everybody who has subscribed over the last couple of videos. Thank you for watching. Best of luck with the test and safe motoring to everyone.